Hello, everybody, and welcome. This is Adrian. Thank you so much for joining me today. It's going to be time for some European Universal 4 in our Albania campaign. We're about to declare one of the Ottomans. We have Skanderbeg, 5550. We have the Ottomans, who have 43,000 troops, no manpower. And at war with the QQ. And we have allies in Hungary and Poland that will join our conflict. My worry is that Venice will declare war on us, but we should be fine. We'll be all right. Austria has actually been relatively not busy. I don't know. Anyway, let's go ahead and declare. My goals are Adirne and Constantinople, but if I can, I want to take everything to the west of the Str Strait of Marmara, the Sea of Marmara. So let's go ahead and see what we can do here. Um, we're actually generating pretty good income. We have a lot of, of debt. We have 343 ducats in debt. I'm hoping that if I take some territory here, we might be able to have some money to pay off some of our, some of our debt and shit. Uh, Bosnia is my, my vassal too, so that's nice. Let's go and unmothball this fleet. Um, I'm waiting for Poland to be done with his war. I guess that's going to take a minute though. We're going to declare here in just a second. I want to get my maintenance up first. You don't have any allies, do you? Theodoro and Crimea? Yeah, we'll be fine. We're going to take a Dirne. Let's go and call in Poland and Hungary. Hungarian manpower fighting in another war. War exhaustion. Okay. Let's go to the Dean. Let's have these Hungarians come on in. Balance of power is thoroughly within my favor. Ottomans have no war exhaustion, really, which is quite curious. We're going to have these Bosnians join with me. A loan offer from the Genoese, I wish. We're on speed three. Uh, let's let the Hungarians clear out those rebels. Let's hopefully have this wrap up fairly soon. Wow, dude, the Teutons took Polos from you, Lithuania? Jesus, what is wrong with you? It might take the Polish a little, a little bit to get down here, I'll admit. They're still thoroughly engaged with the QQ. We're going to take all of these provinces first before my allies do. Because I know that they want some of this land. Uh, hopefully Moldavia does not get there. I think they will. Son of a bastard. Moldavia might take Solistre, but I guess that's fine. I guess that's fine. It's Bulgaria anyway. Who knows if he actually wants it. Okay, there are the Hungarians. We're going to land on a Dirne. And then we're going to go for, yeah, we're going to go for Dirne and Constantinople. Try and hang out there. We don't have any fleet with which to contend with the Ottomans. So let's, like, not even try. Yeah, I thought he would take that. Let's hang out at Dirne. Ooh, there they are. Where the hell are you going, Hungary? Come on, buddy. Come with me this way. Let's go. Yeah, let's go and engage this guy. Um, we have a tech advantage. He's on tech. Oh, son of a bitch. He took tech six. We've still got Skanderbeg. He's still alive. Skanderbeg's still here. So his general is a 4100. He's got some cav, but that's all right. Let's actually go ahead and go for this here. Um, Bosnia, you need to attach, buddy. You cannot be independent. Let's go and engage these guys. We actually should. We should almost probably decisively win this we have a discipline and a morale disadvantage let's actually see how the rules are we get a three to a four bring in oh my god we get a ten to a seven holy shit dude that that level six tech on the ottoman side that was fucking nuts holy shit <laughs> holy shit Dude, we're going to be destroyed right now. Our infantry line completely shattered. Oh my god. We outnumbered this guy substantially and we just got fucked. Holy crap. The Ottomans lost 11,000. We lost just about that number. Oh, dude. That was pretty bad. That was kind of scary. I think Pips might have something to do with it as well. 
He's got more pips in his men. Hmm. Ah, oh, shit, we just took a loan for some reason. Why, exactly? Oh, dear. Oh, dear. That was not good. That was not good at all. I should hire an advisor. I should hire an inquisitor if I can ever get my hands on one. That was pretty gross, man. That was a pretty gross battle. I want to say, I want to engage him again. He's got 15,000 up there. Let's go and hang out here in friendly terrain. Let's get like one more recovery tick. Let's get one more recovery tick and I want to see if I can engage him here. Do I have any, uh, nope, no, no advisors, no advisors for morale. Okay. I was going to say if I had any advisors for, uh, for some combat modifiers or something, we still got, we still got Skanderbeg, you know, he's not, he's not terrible. We don't, we, I think we have a lack of cavalry actually, which is, which is curious. We got 33 to 33 to 17. Um, he might attack me here in Sophia. That would have been nice. Yeah, Poland's busy. Let's go and attack him here. We still got Skanderbeg. Let's see what happens. Uh, we could use morale, but I'm going to take this fight because it's, it's 18,000 to 34. Dude, look at that morale difference. Holy fuck balls. This is the ruler? Wow, my man, the second Fatiha's Monogaloo is a 4100. Incredible. We've got plenty of cav. Plenty of infantry, although morale is a huge, huge, huge difference. We got a 10 to a 2. We got a 2 to a 5. We got a 12. Oh my god! We got a 12 to a 0. Decisive victory. Stack wipe a couple of these small, small guys. Let's see here. So he retreated across there. So I think he crosses. I think he likes to cross in Constantinople. I think it's where he prefers to cross. Instead of a deer nape, per se. Ah, uh, shit. He's, it looks like the Hungarians are going for Constantinople. Can I get there? Ooh, I have to go around. That's curious. So if we get attacked here, I need to be on the lookout for that. Should I hire some more mercs? I've got a lot of forcemen available. I have six regiments out of 22. I could hire some mercs. Yeah, let's go and just grab a couple. Let's go and grab a couple. Hmm. I might put... I have a general here. I have a siege general. I might put him in charge here. Because what I think I can do... Is I think I can have Skanderbeg and the General in two different stacks just kind of hanging out right here. And we still get the Siege bonus, but as well, we get the Military bonus as well. I'm just, I'm curious if he comes along here for this straight. Um, getting some Siege, or getting some Spy Network is going to help us out with Siege ability. The Ottomans have Medium Enthusiasm. He's got no men, whoa, he's got 45,000 men. He's got some manpower coming back. I gotta keep all my troops here. Well, not necessarily. It's actually not entirely true. I don't actually theoretically have to keep my whole army here. Um, what I could possibly do is have troops stay here and just wait for that wait for that crossing. But let's just hang out here for now. Albania, I've got thirty percent participation. Let's see. I've got no I've got no navy to contend with the Ottomans, so I'm not even gonna risk it. They've got a large fleet. I think he's a little busy with the QQ right now, though. You went to war against Ethiopia? Oh shit. Alright, whatever. Yeah, the Polish are busy with their war. 
Honestly, calling them in was probably not even useful or necessary now. Moldavia took this as well. No, there goes Skanderbeg. <laughs> Holy shit, I got a minus two. Holy balls. I wonder why. All right, Skanderbeg, you were good. You were good. He died at 60 years old. Uh, at least we have a regency. That's kind of cool. I didn't. I did not actually know that we had a consort. That was actually uh, unbeknownst to me. So, uh, I I want this prestige. Ooh. I want this prestige, but a loyal clergy would not be bad. Actually. Gain 10 painful influence or prestige. Prestige helps me out with land, ma land morale. Yeah, let's go ahead and get that prestige. I think I need it. Oh my balls. We get a 7 to a 9. Oh, dude, we, just, we, were, we just got defeated right there. We just got fucked up. The Hungarians are still in Constantinople, so that's a constellation, I guess. Uh, God damn. This stability modifier, holy shit. This war is already kind of, it's up in the air. I don't know, man. More, more mercs, sure. Can I, can I afford any more mercs? Um, I don't have any manpower. Let's take a couple mercenaries. God damn it. Let's go to, let's go to mountains. We got to make ourselves unappealing to the enemy. He's going to be Macedonia. Oh, my God. No. He's chasing us. We got four maneuver. Honestly, we can actually probably outrun him. Jesus. Bosnia, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Bosnia. We get a wall breach in Constantinople? Damn, not bad. Uh, We're going to try and meet up with the Hungarians. Let's try. Oh, you fuck. Are you serious? How are you possibly able to catch me, dude? God damn it. Dude, our our stability cost modifier is fucking terrible because our religious unity is zero. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, guys. I don't know if this was the right time for this war, actually. I, I'm actually not... I don't I don't have much of a problem with piecing out. But the Polish are gonna send reinforcements now. They're probably gonna march on What the hell, Bosnia? Really? We have a siege general here. Do you have a siege general? You don't have any siege on that general. Okay. Yeah, sorry, Bosnia. Bye bye. Um the Polish are gonna now reinforce. They're probably gonna invade Crimea. Although Crimea is already occupied by the QQ. Let's try and take Constantinople. I don't think he can dislodge my troops in Constantinople, no matter how hard he tries. I don't think he'd be able to do that. Let's go ahead and focus on admin. Um, I'm tempted to get some, some generals. National manpower modifier is not a bad idea. If I can get a cheap inquisitor, that's what I want. I need an inquisitor. I could do like a, like a level two clergy. Um, an inquisitor at half cost. I believe he costs like three decades a month or something. And I got to start converting some stuff here soon. It's 1470 right now. I have to have basically this whole side converted before the Reformation. Or else we're going to have some pretty serious religious turmoil. But for now, let's just uh, kind of focus on this war. I want to have some points so I can so I can uh, annex. If we take Constantinople into DNA, we might be somewhere. We might be getting... Oh my god. Okay, what do we have here? We've got 29,000 Hungarians. We've got 8,000. We've got a decent general. He's got a 4100, and his other general is a 2130. But he has a tech advantage over the Hungarians and the Polish. Poland's not done with this fucking war yet, man. Oh, no. We're fucked. We are fucked. We're not getting out of this war. We have a 7 to a 2. His troops are so much better. He's got infantry combat ability. 
He's got those Cav. He's got 2-1. He's got Shock 1-1. One, one, unit Morale. They've got more pips. They've got a straight pip advantage. Withdraw. Holy shit. Mm -mm. This is bad. This was a bad, 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 bad war. This might be the this might be the, the end of this campaign right now. We are we are gonna be fucked. There is no way. There is no way that we're getting out of this. Unless the Polish come right now. No way. No, no, no. That's not gonna happen. Fly, you fools! I'm gonna go hang out with the Hungarians for a little while. Run! Run for your lives, you cheap bastards. Oh my god. I can't white peace yet. I'm honestly willing to give him a white peace. Yeah, he wants reconquest on some stuff. We're oh my god. Let's keep an eye on this guy. Yeah, I want a white peace. Dude, stop following me, you son of a bitch. Run! Run! Poland might be able to save us. Poland, are you done with your war? Thank God! Okay. Um. So you're moving into Crimea. We have more war exhaustion than he does now. Let's try to wipe some of these small stacks, possibly. Hmm. Our country's gonna be occupied here in a minute. We don't have any forts, so honestly, we, we really can't do much. War to the Polish. We're here. They're moving into Moldavia. They are now in Moldavia. Here's the Albanians. I still want to. I want to get the stability up. Let's see. I've got some money. I can hire more troops. I I don't know if that's like actually a good thing to do, because I still can't compete with them as far as pips. The pips. The pips is what I'm worried about. He's got plenty of troops to oppose me with. Mercantilism or Diplo? I'm going to take the Diplo. I need some points right now. I'll take this. This is fine. Corfu's and Racing Renaissance. God damn. We're about to occupy Theodore and Crimea. Hmm. We got 21 and 3 moving on our position. No manpower. Bosnia and Hungary, I think we're going to come hang out with me for a little while. Let's go and take a position over here in these highlands. Holy shit. No, Hungary, you son of a bitch. No, we've got rebels again. We're going to be torn asunder. Fuck! We are fucked! No! No! God damn! We're screwed, dude. We're screwed. Oh my god, it's so high. This unrest. This unrest. No way. No way. Oh my god, guys. Fuck. We gotta get out of here. He's he's not willing to he's not he's not gonna peace out, dude. No way. This guy wants three provinces. He's not gonna peace out. That's not gonna happen. There's no fucking way. We cannot defeat this guy. You're fucking serious right now.
We're gonna get these rebels in Morea. Oh my god. Hmm. Let's see. How long is it gonna take you to siege all this, dude? Literally, he's got 45,000 men in Theodoro and Crimea. 45,000. If he engages, we might then have a chance. Austria, you won't come in, right? Yeah, I don't have any favors with you anyway. We're gonna hang on Maria because we're gonna have some rebels here in a second. How many? 10,000? Okie dokie. Damn, 507 manpower. Thank you. We're losing money pretty bad. We're not making any money, I don't, I don't think, anymore. Do we get there before he does? Possibly. It's a minus. It's probably minus one for him. But I guess if he's going to engage me either way. Look at that. Incredible. Incredible. Can we win this battle? I don't know. Uh, Maybe. Literally, dude. We got to get the fuck out of here. We get a... Yeah, he's got a minus one. He got a two to a seven. A three to a seven. A zero to a nine. Oh my god. Look at these rolls. And we still lose. A nine to a two. Decisive fucking defeat. We lost 11,000. He lost just about that number as well. Incredible, dude. He just bought down his war exhaustion too. I can't believe it. I cannot fathom it right now. Is that literally how important Tech 6 was? That we are literally going to just be destroyed right now by this guy? Holy shit. Holy shit. No way. Now we got separatists that I can't deal with. We are so screwed. We just took Theodoro though. That's kind of nice. Oh, man. He's on pest. Hungary's going to want to peace out. Hungary's at low enthusiasm. He's going to wipe peace Hungary right now. We're screwed. Let's see. He'd peace out for two provinces, Macedonia and Nice. I wonder if I offered him just one. Macedonia, Macedonia, and Nice. Um, I'm actually willing to give him Macedonia and Nice. Believe it or not, I'm actually willing to do it. It's seven development here. Macedonia is pretty important, but I'm willing to do it. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, that's interesting. He wants this land and he'll take Nice. And everybody would distrust me for signing a separate piece. That's interesting. Hmm. I'm willing to do it. Actually, that that is something I'm willing to accept. Nice is only 7 development for me, and then this is 7 development for Hungary. Fuck it. If I have to, I have to. I'm going to lose some trust with everybody. Uh, let's see, Kush Connors, thank you so much for following on Twitch. I'm going to lose some trust with some people, but I'm willing to do it. We'll bounce back from it a little later. Right now, the Separatists are my primary concern. God damn it, nobility. You guys suck. I don't like you, nobility. It's 
Annex Bosnia. No. As long as I can take. 1476. Only four years to take that territory. That's fine. That's fine. They embrace the Renaissance. Shift Consolidate. We've got basically a bunch of mercs. No manpower. Let's train up just a couple more mercs. And we're going to improve relations now with our former allies. Or I guess with our allies, but possibly soon to be former allies. Because Hungary, actually Hungary's, Hungary likes me. Um, Austria, what about Poland? Okay. We lost one province. We can bounce back though. We can bounce back. The Ottomans though, man. They're scary. My primary concern right now is to get rid of our debt and to start converting this shit out of all of our country. Can't call it a yet there. Oh my god, and we lost our god general. We have a 1 3 1. Eh, that's actually not bad. 3 shock, I'll take it. You're going to Epirus, huh? Okay. Those rebels are going to attack us here. Yeah, I guess our I guess our god general died. I didn't know that. Our uh, our 3 3 5, I guess is who he was. All right. Yeah, we got a lot of separatists in the way. Inflation is incredibly high. I'm going to try and reduce it somehow. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. We'll work on it. We'll work on it. I just want to replenish. I'm going to do straight consolidate. I've got loads of mercs, dude. Literally just, just tons of mercenaries. I can't afford manpower. I don't have any manpower. Are you serious, Hungary? <laughs> You're going to come and attack these separatists for me? Dude, you're so awesome. Damn, I love you, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. He's got nine and four. I need to get some. I, I need to get my hands on some cav. That'd probably be a really good idea. Oh, you're fucking kidding me, really? Oh, we still get there early. Nice, good stuff. A minus three for the rebels. That's what happens when you revolt, you fat bastards. We got Orthodox Zealots. <sighs> Jesus. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I am still seriously considering converting to Orthodox. Honestly, I think we'd lose some of our alliances, but we would not have any more unrest ever. Like, is that is that worth it? Like, that's a really good question. Is it worth it? You know, wow, we actually got rid of our war exhaustion. Sweet. I don't know. Who knows? We're paying three ducats a month in, in mercs. We have 258 ducats of debt, 20 force limit. We used to have 22, I believe. Although, once we annex Bosnia, that'll, that'll help us out a little bit. Let's see. Orthodox Zealots. Akane Separatists will rise up. We've got Albanian Noble Rebels. Hmm. Well, at least, we, at least we have the country back under kind of sort of control. Let's pay back this these loans, because this interest is going to kill us. Although we're not doing too bad. We only have three loans. It's It could be a lot worse, actually. We were doing a lot worse before. Um, autonomy is really not too bad, actually. Autonomy could be a lot worse. Nice. Good battle there. Orthodox Zealots. We actually might be able to put down those Zealots. Yeah, actually, I think we can shift consolidate here. This will actually probably decrease, I think. Yes, thank you, Lord. Okay, 1474, huh? We can finally get rid of some of these separatists and some of these rebels and things. Still got to convert some stuff. I'm actually going to probably hire... I will hire this level 2 Inquisitor when I can. Um, I will hire the level 2 Inquisitor for sure. And we need to really just kind of start converting stuff. Um, in fact, let's go ahead and just do it now. I think I might call the diet on this guy. How 
How much is he? He's 2.4 per month, huh? It's a little expensive. Let's go ahead. Let's let's hire him as soon as I can get rid of some of these loans. And we'll hire him. And then I think we'll be a little better off with converting stuff. Yeah, Poland, you came in handy for for um, a little while, I think, for defensive calls. He, ma he makes sense for defensive calls, not offensive calls, though. I don't think so. Your independence is still guaranteed by the Ottomans? Damn, bro. Shit. All right. Maybe Venice is actually a target. Venice is... We can attack Venice. The Knights, Ferrara, and Luca are their allies. Plus a lot of trade leagues and stuff. We can probably attack Venice. We're not doing too bad on tech. Um, Admin and Diplo could be better. Could be worse. Oh, shit. Are we going to see this personal union? I hope we do. Shit. I'm not going to lie. Having a non-independent Hungary actually works out for me. Works out in my favor. Oh, shit. The King of Austria had laid claim to Hungary. They're still allies, though, so there won't be any war. There actually would be a war between Austria and Hungary if this guy died. He's 27 years old. Fascinating. I need 80 decades to repay some of these loans. Let's see, we're going to be capped on a military here. Um, what can I do? We still have this Queen Regent, huh? This 231. Regent Teresa Benedictive on Habsburg. I can't strengthen the government. Um, military tradition sucks. I'll do one more leader, I guess, if I have to spend a few points. That's fine. Wow, he's a three shock. Okay. Hell, I'll take it. I'll take what I can get. I'll take what I can get. Let's make sure we cap our relations with all of our allies, I think. Venice, I'm coming for you, probably. I think if we attack Venice, take some of that territory. I think some of it's Catholic, actually. Nope, actually, most of most of Greece is Orthodox still. Um, I think if we attack Venice, take Corfu, Negropont, Naxos, Crete. Although I need to core stuff right now, or I need to convert stuff right now, but we'll be all right. We'll be better. We'll be fine. Yeah, strength in government would work. I'm going to use this strength in government for that 10 leg legitimacy a little later. Not now, though. Ottomans have announced me as a rival. I still need to make the Serbs... Accepted culture, yeah, that's right. I meant to do that a while ago, actually. Mm. Section privileges with the Pope. Make sure we get some papal influence. Times of need, huh? Manpower would be nice. Asking for money? Money would be nice, too, to repay, yeah, repay some of this stuff. Hmm, manpower, sure. Why don't you give me some manpower, Hungary? See what you say. We're a little behind on Diplo, but actually, I'm going to take this. We're going to make Serbian an accepted culture. We're, we're two out of two right now, so it's like, come on. What else am I going to do? What's up with these Orthodox Zealots? Oh, wow, they actually gave me, wow, we got plus 75 relations. They gave me... Oh, we're going to get Bosnian troops. Thank gosh. Um, Hungary gave me 2,000 manpower. And then we're going to get Bosnian troops. That's right. He's at 6K right now. So that's awesome. That works out so good. Holy crap. And then we can make a state too. How many states do we have currently? 14 provinces and 14. So that means I guess 14 states right now. Not 14 states. Is it unless well, it is possibly. Finally, Hungary, you embrace that damn renaissance. You guys have Miltech 6 now. Jesus. You know how long I've been waiting for that? Thank you. Thank you, Bosnia, for the troops. Oh, you're such a darling. Excellent. 
Let's see. Clergy wants some land. Let's give him some base tax, I guess. Because actually, this is going to have some unrest and stuff. Uh, whom sounds best. Yeah. And I think that'll help me convert some of this territory. It will, actually. Well, whom's already Catholic, but... Yeah, we'll see about some of this. Not bad. Not bad. So now we have some troops here. Um, we finally have Cav. Can you believe it? 18,000 Serbs. Oh, that's right. We already are at full maintenance. Wow, we're making 3.16 ducats a month at full maintenance with 17,000 troops. Not too shabby, actually. That's not too bad, huh? Could be a lot worse. I want to take my position in Zeta. Uh, what the hell was that? Wait, what? Oh, look at that. Our queen consort died. So for now, Constantine the, uh, Constantine Stratioti, we have a 201 as our regency council. Oh, well, that's curious. Okay. Huh, interesting. All right, you say so. Yeah, I, dude, it's been a while since I've seen one of those one of those tooltips. Holy shit, that's weird. So, all right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and take a quick break here. Thank you so much for watching, as always. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. I actually do think this run is going a lot better than the previous Albania run. So, yeah. All right, guys, I will see you in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, as always. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. I'll see you guys very soon. Thanks so much.